It's Monday, January 30th, 2012. Here's New York. And look what came in the mail! Hey! I just woke up from a nap, so forgive the hair. So, in 2007, Sufjan Stevens, the performer of the oboe, along with countless other instruments, and songwriter who created the wonderful album Illinois, the album Michigan, uh, did this, uh, the BQE. Um, in 2000, in that year, he performed it in front of thousands of people at the Howard Gilman Opera House at BAM, uh, who commissioned the work. And it was a triptych film about the Brooklyn Queens Expressway with instrumental music. And what this, two years later, uh, when it was released, became was sort of a remnant of that. It has all the music on a CD. The DVD of the 50-minute film that Stevens co-produced and a whole book of photographs and liner notes and then this weird thing. It's a Viewmaster reel. <laughs> he thought of everything. I mean, he also did a comic book and even more photos with the vinyl edition, but I don't have the money for that. This is a used copy. It shows you how, how spendthrift I am. All in all, I watched the movie and it was kind of underwhelming. They're trying to convey everything about the Brooklyn Queens Expressway in a 50 minute video of just images is tough, especially when you try and, and horn in this weird metaphor about the hula hoop. The music is damn near remarkable. One of the reasons I love Sufjan Stevens' work is that he's really able to not just write songs but compose and you know, he's, the way I describe, describe his work is symphonic pop, and this really exemplifies it. You hear elements of Gershwin, elements of Aaron Copland, and you hear elements of Sufjan Stevens. It's, it's symphonic pop meets, you know, electronic at times, and it's pretty damn good. So I'm going to say, listen to the CD, ask the DVD, it's kind of skippable. As for the rest of the stuff today, a couple of announcements. First of all, a new haul of CDs from your public library. I got MIA, Death Cab for Cutie, and BDI, because I'm a library freeloader. Video is about the New York Public Library to be coming shortly. It's the start of the spring semester at Hunter, meaning that I won't be able to record videos every day, but I will continue releasing videos every day. What I'm going to do is, I already have a backlog of about another month worth of videos, and to supplement that, of course, I'll be recording on Tuesdays and Fridays, because Fridays I have no classes, and Tuesdays I have just one class. So that is taken care of. And then finally, for Groundhog Day, in honor of Groundhog Day, for whatever reason, um, I am giving blood because I suppose while Punxsutawney Phil down in Pennsylvania and our own Staten Island Chuck will be prognosticating whether there'll be uh, spring coming soon or six more weeks of winter, there's still going to be a need for blood and you can give it, I can give it. Go to nybloodcenter.org to schedule an appointment with the New York Blood Center. If you live inside New York, if you live outside New York, go to redcross.org and schedule an appointment to give blood and help save lives because saving lives is awesome. Your question is, will Staten Island Chuck bite Mayor Bloomberg? More info on that on February 2nd. And everyone, uh, everything else, uh, see you tomorrow.